Hello, this time we will talk about an economic calendar. What is it? How does it work? How to use it to make money quickly? The first thing you need to know is where the economic calendar comes from, who creates it. There is no universal economic calendar that would display all possible financial events. Any company can create its own calendar of economic events and publish it on its website. Usually such calendars are published by top data analytics companies or some international brokerage firms. But why should they all do the same job, economic events being the same for everyone? The thing is that if you publish all the financial news of all countries, you will get a huge list in which approximately 80 to 90% of events will not affect the market at all. Compilers of the calendar have to filter out insignificant news, and also provide their own subjective assessment of the importance of each economic event. For example, the popular website Investing rates the importance of each piece of news on a scale of 1 to 3. You can notice it by the number of stars next to the planned event. Another website, Trading Economics, highlights in bold type the most important economic events, from their point of view. Their calendar does not highlight events of medium importance, there are only important news and everything else. Sometimes you can see that in one calendar the news is marked as very important, and in another calendar as an event of medium importance. This happens because all these assessments are subjective. As you grow in experience, you will also be able to distinguish between economic events on the calendar. They are repeated at different intervals, so you will have your own views on which piece of news might have an impact on the market, and which event might not. How strongly can the news affect market quotes? Let's have a look at this example. Here we have a Japanese candlestick chart, which is set to a 1 minute time frame. I think you easily identified the spot on the chart where important economic news was announced. You can also check out this video. Here I use my news strategy to make money on the publication of important economic information. I sped up the video on purpose to show you how things unfolded. Let me remind you that the news trading strategy, as well as my other trading systems, are fully described, analyzed and demonstrated in the free course that is available to everyone. Let's return to the economic calendar. By the example of investing, we will look at the composition of such a calendar and learn which information it provides. The first thing you should pay attention to is the settings above the calendar. Here you can set your time zone for your convenience, and you can add or remove economic events of specified countries from the calendar. In addition, we can track events for today, tomorrow, over the entire current or next week. This feature is very useful when planning your trading schedule. Today I already know at what time important news will be released before the end of this week, which can shake up the market and bring in money. The first column on the left is the time of the announcement of economic information in the chosen time zone. The next column displays the flag of the country in which the news is released, as well as the designation of its national currency. The next column shows us the subjective assessment of the importance of news. In the investing calendar, there can be one, two, or three stars next to an economic event. The more such stars, the more important the news. For starters, I recommend following the information that I publish every weekday in my Telegram channel. In this channel, I share my reviews on what news is worth paying attention to in order to make money using the news strategy, and what news you'd better ignore. I will share the link to my Telegram channel in the description of this video. If you pick news on your own, in order to apply that news strategy, first select three star events on the calendar. Also, you should avoid speeches, which are usually marked with a speaker icon on calendars. For example, if the speaker icon news concerns the US dollar, then abstain from using US dollars in trading even in other strategies for 15 to 30 minutes from the start of the speech. Unfortunately, there is no way to know in advance how long a speech will last, so I usually wait out about 15 minutes if the speaker is insignificant to the financial market and 30 minutes if the speaker is an influential figure. For instance, you need to be careful with the speeches of the head of the US Federal Reserve, the head of the European Parliament and similar figures. The accumulation of news have a higher probability of a considerable impact on the market, that is, when several economic news of one country are released at the same time. A single piece of news does not usually have any strong impact on the market. What comes to mind now is only preliminary data on unemployment in the non-farm sector of the United States. As a rule, these economic data are isolated and have potential to significantly change the market value of the US dollar. The next column contains the events, and on the right side you can see three columns with numbers. Here we have actual, forecast and previous values. Let's start with the rightmost column. 
previous values are those economic indicators that were announced on the same news, but the time before. As I've mentioned, each piece of news is released at certain intervals, and we can see the previous data related to the news we are interested in. Forecast is the assumption of the analysts who compiled this economic calendar. Of course, this column displays subjective information, the forecast of specific people. If we compare the forecast value for one selected piece of news of the economic calendar with the forecast for the same event of another calendar, then most likely they will differ. The actual column is filled after the announcement of economic events. Here you can see the actual information that was announced. As you may have guessed, these economic data will be published in the previous values column the next time this economic event appears on the calendar. Economic events in Europe, the USA, Great Britain are best suited for making money on economic news, and you can also watch out for events from Canada. News from Japan, New Zealand, Australia is not a perfect fit, as these events are announced when the European markets are closed and there is a lack of liquidity. Other economic calendars are similar. They may have a different number of news importance ratings, there may be no forecast column, or there may be other minor features. Some news may be present in one calendar and be absent in another. Naturally, important economic events will be posted on all calendars, but less significant news may be added by compilers of one calendar and filtered out by compilers of another calendar. I hope this short overview of the economic calendar using investing as an example has helped you better understand how these new schedules work and how to use them. If you have not yet taken my free trading course, in which I tell and show in detail how to make money on economic news and more, then I highly recommend that you pay attention to it. You can find the link to the course is in the description of this video on YouTube. I wish you successful trades. See you.